Lads and Linets, welcome back. Let's uncover our new team member. Why would someone so fanatical sacrifice himself for one Krogan? Crack it open. Let's see what a pure Krogan's got. Yeah, he is hard to pass up, to be fair. A pure warrior? And the Krogans are damn good at fighting. Pure Krogan could pack a hell of a punch. We can always use another heavy hitter. If he'll help. I doubt anyone's asked for his opinion. Normandy, Okir is a no-go, but we have a package that needs retrieval. And he's a big one. <laughs> he's a big one. Okay. Finished our mission. The cloning facility has been destroyed. Okia has been killed, but his son was recovered. Loss of Okia could be a problem. We'll allow Shepard to decide whether to activate Krogan. Um, all Krogan squad members get a 25% health. Sniper rifle damage, which is cool. I don't think we've got any sniper rifles just yet, so God knows what's going to happen now. Man, we are really going for it in Mass Effect at this moment in time. We'll have recruited three people, three, four people to the team by this point. That's crazy. This is going to be my last episode for the, for the time being. Um, at least recording-wise, you guys aren't going to notice, but I need to get something to eat because I'm hungry. Sense, but I have concerns about waking it. Yeah, you've said that a few times now. A normal Krogan is dangerous. This one was created and likely educated by a madman. Mm. I see everyone's enjoying the new paperweight. Concerns? We don't know anything about it, Commander. It's true, he could be a real issue. I'm not saying we take a crowbar to it right now, but I'm not giving up a potential resource. It's your decision, Commander. Just be careful. Noted. The cargo hold is safe enough while I decide what to do with him. Thanks for your input there, Jacob. Still a member of the team, my friend. So decide whether or not to open the grow tank of the Krogan Super Soldier. Ah, it's so difficult. <sighs> Let's talk to Mordin. He might know, uh, Mordin, I mean, he might know a little bit more about the Krogan and help us. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Not at the moment. Think I've unlocked collector interest in humans. Wait, no. Only one heart. Krogan have two. Scratch that. Anything else? He is interesting. Any ideas on other ways to prepare for the collectors? Ideas, yes. Expensive, but possibly valuable. Can show you. I think these are the ones we just get anyway. So we can get assault rifle, sniper rifle. I think someone's got assault rifle actually, so I'm going to get the assault rifle damage upgrade. Just, just because. So let's have a look. Ship enhancements, is there anything we can get just yet? No. We can increase our... Omnitool tech power damage. Uh, Omnitool to match speed neutral patterns. Once turned, this man is almost usable to anyone but the wearer. It's constantly recalibrated to sort of neural shifts. Yeah, you know what? Let's buy that. And I think we can buy the Medigel capacity as well, I presume. But how much is it? 5,000? It's not been completely key as yet. We can't buy anything. What about the prototypes? Krogan Vitality. Uh, a retrovirus that matches the Krogan genetic code. Modifying the gene sequence of the virus and injecting a small amount uh, into a Krogan can introduce a change in that genetic code. Not really too fussed about that. I am going to buy some heavy weapons ammo because that was something I was really struggling with before. So let's just have a look, shall we? Oh, we can get a missile launcher. Yeah, boy. That'd be really cool. Uh, I don't really want to go and speak to Jacob. I might go and speak to Garrus. Uh, and the such. Let's just uh, go and see if we've got any messages from the private terminal. The elusive man wishes to speak to you. Oh. Room, oh. We can go and speak to the elusive man. Well, we're definitely going to do that. Just I need to remember where the hell the briefing room is. <laughs> it is on here. So where the hell is it? I'm terrible at finding my way around these places. Come on. I presume it's in here. Let's speak to the elusive man. I'd be interested to see what he's got to say, actually, at this point. Shepard, I think we have them. 
Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morden delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. Uh oh. One of your former crew, Caden Alenko, is stationed on Horizon. Oh. What? Last I knew, Caden was Alliance. Why is he out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relations with the colonies, but they're up to something. And if they sent Commander Alenko, it must be big. I suggest you take it up with him. He's a commander now. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew. I don't buy it. It shouldn't be a surprise the Collectors are interested in you, especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after him to get to you. Interesting. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. So, we've got another, another mission. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the Professor. Aye, aye, Commander. Tell me you have something. Is that a smile? Yes. Yes. Looks like a bit of armor that we can use. So we're heading straight to this mission, which is interesting. I wasn't kind of expecting to go straight into a mission, but hey, why not? Oh, it's very pretty. Lilith, we've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Commander. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. What is that? Get everyone to the safe house. I'll cover you. Run. Hurry. I had some creep shit. That's pretty intense. 
Now who are we going to take? Oh, I'd like to take Miranda. I mean, Jack was helpful, but I'm not really too fussed. Morden seemed to know what he was doing, but I really like Garrus. You know what? Let's change it up a tad. I won't take Garrus this time. Let's take those two. See what happens. Oh, we've leveled up as well, which is nice. Um... Let's increase our cryo ammo. Yeah, I'm happy with that. So we've got two points left. Um, let's give you another addition to warp. And you've got two points left, which I don't think I can do anything with right now, Morden. Sorry, bro. <laughs> Sorry, friend. You're a good man, though. Um, da, 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 da. I might change my guns, actually, thinking about it. And take a missile launcher. Oh, yeah. So, we've got the hand cannon or the predator. Gonna go for the hand cannon this time. Um, and I think that's all we can have right now. That's cool. Right. There are a lot of... Look at that! That is kind of ridiculous. Not a fan. Yeah, let's find out a little bit more about the uh, the horizon, actually. Uh, da, 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 da. Planets and locations. Actually, it'll probably be in primary then, won't it? Freedom, horizon, here we go. A typical terminus colony possessing minimal tourist value. Horizon promises substantial economic opportunity, especially in providing new products for humans and supplying a Turian hierarchy. Surveyed 18 years ago, Horizon received pilot habitation four years later. The colony proper is now eight years old. Blessed with verdant forests and abundant fresh water, Horizon maintains a colonial culture that thrives as a refuge from the increasing restrictions of Citadel-governed society. Horizon has attracted numerous dissidents, marginal people, and fringe dwellers from across Alliance space. Cool. That's... Morden, you sure these armor upgrades will protect us from the Seeker Swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confused detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. <laughs> in theory? Experimental technology. Only test is contact with Seeker Swarms. Have to test them in person. Should be exciting. Okay, we've got our first enemies here. We're taking on the Collectors directly right now, which is kind of scary, but also kind of cool. Okay, their weapons are really freaking powerful. But so are mine. Who's causing trouble over here then? You. These things are really weird looking. What if I get flanked? Because I could get flanked, I suppose. I love Morden's incinerator. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Look at that gun. That is a really cool weapon that they've got. I am concerned that they will kill me quite quickly here. But I'm doing what I can here. Oh, yeah, I forgot about ammo powers. Let's pop some of this on it. Oh, God. These collectors are pretty scary. I mean, that where's that tower gone? That is just spectacular. So big. And I'm kind of concerned that everyone's been taken here. Get some heavy weapon ammo, which is what we needed. Fragile crates, not a problem. But there is a date pad, which we can hack. So hopefully there will be something cool. 6,000 credits is not to be sniffed at whatsoever. Um, white, big space. There we go. And then just the last one, really, which I can't seem to find. There we go, 6,000 credits. Lots of credits to do the upgrades that we need to upgrade. 
if we can get those guns online. Oh my god. It's like the uh, the krill from Gears of War, which if you guys remember, that bit was pretty horrifying. Collector ship disrupting communications. We're on our own now. No. What the hell is that? Because I'm not happy about it. No, not happy. Not happy whatsoever about anything that's going on right now. Can I flank these guys? Oh, it's definitely happening. It is definitely happening. I'm going to use my uh, my push ability as well. I'm going to proper flank these guys. Are you ready? What the hell are they? Oh god, the husks are back. Oh, no. No. Kill this dude. How did I not see you? Ah. Okay, these guys are going to be a little bit more problematic than I expected. Where's this other dude? However, we are kicking some serious butt right now. And those those heated those rounds. Like the husks that Geth used on the yeah, crime. that's what Geth I thought they were. That technology from Sovereign. Elusive man was right. Collectors working with reapers. Heavy skin weave. I presume that's to improve our armor, which is cool if that's the case. And we've got a dead husk, so they are working with the reapers. Mm. Husks have human characteristics, possibly repurposed colonists. No. On Eden Prime, victims were turned into husks by impaling them on spikes. We haven't seen any. The collectors must have brought the husks. They're taking the colonists alive for something else. <laughs> Living victims, that's grim. That's really unprofessional. I wouldn't do that. But they do look a little bit different from the ones that I remember. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. They can still be killed. <sighs> the collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Yes, ma'am. You could probably much build your, in, your Paragon and stuff. No signs of resistance. These people are a bit more difficult to kill. What the hell? These must be the, the pods that they put them in. Right, I need you guys to really start doing something. But can we use some powers? Christ, I'm getting killed here. And we've got a sniper up in the, the room up top. I'm going to have to flank that guy. Really not time for a hack, is it? <laughs> and not for the amount that I'm getting either. Come on. Where are we? There we go. 4800, not too bad. Is there more? Did we kill them all? Oh, well done, well done team. Well done. I have a feeling there's going to be more coming up. I'm going to save my game. And I'm going to stop the episode here. We're going to continue to find out what the hell is going on here. And what the collectors are exactly doing. And hopefully save our old pal, Kaiden. Thank you very much for watching, Lanzaladets. And while we sit in the incredible scope of the ship that is pointing towards the sky, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.